an officer remembered. This afternoon, hundreds of police lined the way as the casket carrying Buddy Christian passed by with his grieving family following close behind. Tonight, the touching moments that brought both laughter and tears. Good evening. I'm Linda Stouffer. John Bachman is off tonight. Athens Clark County Police Officer Buddy Christian was shot and killed Tuesday. Channel 2's Tony Thomas was there for the simple yet powerful funeral service. He joins us live. Tony. Linda, this was a very emotional service, as you might expect, but as you said, also very simple. Three songs and two speakers. That was all. When I entered the Classic Center, I was handed this program, his picture on the front. Inside, it reads simply, a hero has fallen and caught a carriage ride to heaven. We come today, our hearts are heavy, as we already missed, buddy. It's due to end it. March 22nd. The body of slain Athens Clark County officer Buddy Christian arrives at the cemetery. Hundreds of people line the path as the carriage is followed by Christian's family. Nearby, a simple salute from a child. This processional lasted more than 30 minutes. Hundreds of police cars from across the southeast falling in line behind a fallen officer. Inside Athens Classic Center, Athens Police Chief Joe Lumpkin nearly breaks down as he talks about the eight-year veteran. Elma Buddy Christian's name is a perfect reflection of the man Buddy was dead. Christian died Tuesday afternoon, shot while investigating a carjacking. Christian's pastor tried to address the anger many people have toward accused killer Jamie Hood, now behind bars. Does he know the devastation that he has caused? And does he know what he has taken from this family and these friends? Athens being the town it is, it'll shake it off. We'll get our heads held high again. But today we bow. Eight-year veteran Buddy Christian is survived by his wife and two small children ages five and two years old. In Athens, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News. My heart goes out to those two small children. Tony, thank you very much. Metro Atlantans are helping Officer Christian's family by donating to a memorial fund. It's set up at Athens First Bank. We have the bank's address on our website, WSBTV.com. Just look on our homepage for that. Now, the other officer shot, Tony Howard, is showing some promising signs tonight. The officer is now in good condition. He's talking. He's alert. Officer Howard underwent surgery last week. He was shot twice. The father of four was the first officer to encounter accused killer Jamie Hood during a traffic stop. We are staying in contact with authorities in Clark County on when accused killer Jamie Hood will go before a judge. We showed you Hood's surrender to police live Friday night. He is now back in the Clark County Jail. He went there after his arrest and authorities transferred him to the Hall County Jail in Gainesville. Hood stayed there for about a day. Go to WSBTV.com to see the